You'd be mistaken if you thought COVID-19 has a knack for lingering in a room. Coronavirus is not something that hangs in the air. Mayor de Blasio, just like the rest of us, getting a daily education on how the virus works person to person. How does that happen? A sneeze that gets right on you, someone's talking right up close to you and inadvertently spits a little bit while they're talking. Governor Cuomo pointing out it's fiction to think COVID-19 is anywhere near as deadly as the Ebola virus. People are reacting like this is the Ebola virus. This is not the Ebola virus. Ebola typically kills at least 50% of patients. COVID-19 has been lethal between 1 and 3% of the time. And the elderly are most at risk or those with compromised immune systems. Underlying conditions, heart disease, lung disease, kidney disease, diabetes. Which brings us to an unsettling fact about the virus. As the CDC notes, cruises put large numbers of people, often from countries around the world, in frequent and close contact with each other. This can promote the spread of respiratory viruses. The cruise industry has struck back, calling the singling out of tourist ships unreasonable and unwarranted. According to the CDC, it's fiction to believe that viruses and germs spread easily on planes, quote, because of how air circulates and is filtered on airplanes. Yet all bets are off if you're seated near a sick passenger. Fact, COVID-19 spreads between people who are in close contact with one another. The fact remains, otherwise healthy children and young adults have a good chance of recovery. Younger people are always going to have uh, more resiliency.